This is WCPO 9 News. Thanks for joining us for WCPO 9 News. I'm Tamika Artist. Here's a look at some of today's top stories. Cincinnati firefighters dodged flying debris during this car fire and explosion. It happened just before midnight, right near the intersection of Reading Road and Elsinore Place, just a short distance from our studios. As you can see, the SUV was fully engulfed by the time firefighters got there. No one was hurt, but the car is a total loss. A tri-state lawmaker planning to introduce a bill this coming week that would strip away emergency powers used by Ohio Governor Mike DeWine and Health Director Dr. Amy Atkin. That bill proposed by State Representative John Becker, a Republican from Union Township, would immediately make all health orders advisories instead of mandatory unless approved by lawmakers. And it would also retroactively apply to all orders issued by Dr. Acton as well as any future ones. Well, it is the Flying Pig Marathon, but with a coronavirus twist. The marathon has been postponed until October, but so far, more than 5,000 people have signed up for a virtual race. There is also a Flying Pig Sidewalk Design Challenge and Flying Pig Porch Pours from noon until 1. Organizers say that they will have virtual champagne toasts and cocktail recipes. Well, the Red Rifle is now a gunslinger for the Dallas Cowboys. Former Bengals quarterback Andy Dalton has agreed to a one-year contract with the team worth up to $7 million. That's according to multiple sources with ESPN. He's expected to back up Cowboys starting quarterback Dak Prescott. Well, here's a check of your nine first warning forecast now with meteorologist Austin Winfield. Well, to make it looks like rain showers are in the forecast on again, off again for most of the day. Fortunately, things taper off as we go into dinner time. Those clouds and those rain showers will begin to leave and we'll see some clear skies in the forecast for tonight. 45 degrees with rain chances again decreasing. But here's a look at what you can expect for tomorrow.